Hello everybody, Joe here, and happy Tuesday. So it is the Tuesday before Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. Where I live, it is currently snowing outside. I have the Bing Crosby Holiday Radio Station on Pandora. Because, you know, nothing beats some good old Bing Crosby, you know, classic radio music that you grew up with. Also drinking out of my Christmas mug. Having coffee with a little bit of eggnog in it. So good. So I just wanted to come on here and wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holiday. As with this holiday being so different for everybody, I just wanted to send love and peace and joy out to everyone and to remember to be thankful and grateful and to appreciate what you do have. I know from the way my family's talked that I will be receiving Christmas presents this year. And in Christmas's past, that would have bugged me because, you know, living minimally, it's just kind of like the opposite. And I prefer quality time over gifts, but I am fortunate that I have that I'll get to spend some quality time with family and one of the things I will be doing is one of Mickey making one of my grandma's recipes. My grandma passed away is it 10 years ago now? And I miss her a lot. But I love that we still have some of her recipes. And that I think this is the first holiday where I've made one of her holiday recipes for the family and done it. Normally when my siblings or my mom has taken on that task in the past. So I'm really excited to be doing that tradition this year. I'm really looking forward to the time we're gonna have I understand that some people aren't as fortunate and just know that if you aren't able to, that I just sending you all the Christmas happiness, all the holiday happiness, sending you all the hugs and love and just wishing you the best. Um... And also know that, you know, like me, when you receive Christmas gifts this year, if you receive gifts this year, that if they're not things you value or love or want, it's okay to get, get rid of them. I know it ruffles family's feathers, it ruffles people's feathers, but just know that them gifting you something was the purpose and them showing their love and you can still love it and appreciate it without feeling the need to keep it of course if you do love and value something absolutely keep it 
but just know you don't have to. So if you want to let me know about any new traditions or family traditions you are doing, carrying on, I would love to hear about them either in the comments below or on Instagram where you can email me. So I'm going to go back to enjoying my eggnog coffee and looking out at the snow and listening to Christmas music. So once again, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and if you don't celebrate, then have a great week, and I'll see you all after the holiday. Bye!